Today we're gonna be doing a science experiment, and it's the vol a volcano. You'll need wheat flour, and we'll need a measuring cup and a volcano plate mold, mm -hmm. mold and we'll need a plate, and we we won't need the food coloring and a pipette and a wooden spatula and safety goggles. And the plate. So, go ahead and read and the first step, step to us, Stacy. One second. Hmm. One second, audience. <laughs> okay, let's do one. Step one. Let's do step one. Okay, read step one to us. Put the volcano mold in the deep in a deep plate. Okay, there she is. Now, number two. Add two coffee spoons of sodium bicarbonate, bicarbonate, which is Alka-Seltzer. And so we don't have spoonfuls; we have tablets. So we'll put two tablets in there. Now what? And one spoon of wheat flour. Claire, get us a spoon out of the drawer. Okay, this is homemade wheat flour because we didn't have any. So we took our wheat seeds that we had and we ground them up in this mixer. And I think this is probably a little bit bigger than we need. So we'll do this. Does this look good? Mm -hmm. Pour it in? Yes. There's our wheat flour. It got over all over, so you might do that too. It might, that's right. So it says measure 15 milliliters of vinegar in the small measuring cup with the Pasteur pipette and add four drops of red food coloring. Stir the mixture with a clean spatula. You can do any food coloring. And we're using pink today. 15 milliliters, Claire. Okay. That would be to this line right here. Okay, one second. <laughs> would you hold it up so I can pour in the 15 milliliters of vinegar? Okay, Claire has the 15 milliliters of vinegar. And now, JC, take the food coloring. We won't need the pipette because our food coloring has a dropper on the top. Four. Okay, now we put the lid back on, and Claire, you can stir the vinegar and, and food coloring. Pink is turning pink. Mm-hmm, the vinegar is turning pink. Thanks. JC, would you like to move that out so our video can see it really well? And now it says, can put the vinegar with the coloring inside the volcano. Okay, everyone, you pull up some. You want to do it with the pipette? Mm -hmm. Yeah, leave it where Claire can see it, too. But, ooh, I just got that coloring on me when I touched your spatula. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Oh, not a lot yet. Not a lot yet. Let's see. Claire, do you want to pour some on it? Mm -hmm. I'll let JC do one more pipette. Uh, some of it's bubbling out. Claire, pour the rest of that on, too our volcano. Yay, volcano! The <laughs> volcano is done! Oh, look, look, the bubbles are starting to come up. I bet if I pour some more on there, we'll get more bubbles. Let's add a little more vinegar. That looks red. Mm-hmm. We just made it red. Yeah, we made it red. Look at there, now it's bubbling out. You see our volcano erupting with all the bubbles? Mm -hmm. and the vinegar and sodium bicarbonate mixing in there. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the show! Here we go again for the next project. We are going to try the same one again, but do it a little different to see if we get a different result. Yes, we are. To see if it bubbles faster. So what are we going to put in first this time? The Alka-Seltzer. Alka-Seltzer. And then we'll put in some vinegar here. This time we're not going to do the wheat flour. We're going to try a little bit more vinegar. Mm -hmm. And put a little bit of color in it. Just 
go ahead and put the color in there. That's good. That's enough. And then Claire used this no, to stir, stir it. Let Claire stir it. She got to do that part. And then you can pour it in really slowly from the spout. And we're going to just take the wheat flour out of the equation. Look, it's more. And let's see what happens this time. And she pours it in slowly. Oh, let's see what, stop and see what happens. Ah, now our volcano is really bubbling. So I think, what do you think, Claire? Do you think it worked better with the wheat flour or without the wheat flour? With the wheat flour. The first time, you think it bubbled better the first time? No, this one. Oh, so without the wheat flour. You got a lot better bubbles without the wheat flour. It looks more orangey than pink. It does. Maybe maybe the vinegar changes the color a little bit. Yeah. What conclusion did you draw about our two experiments, JC? What did you learn from doing the experiment two different ways? That it works better without it. Without what? The wheat flour. Ah. So say, come back and do more science with us. Come, come back, back and do more science with us, please. <laughs> and uh, that's the end. And you might want this Elka Sizer. Elka